and chat. How's it going, guys? Welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3, uh, where we are still in the Underdark. I'm about to go to the, uh... Oh, what is the descriptor of the forge? It's a, it's a giant forge. We're about to uh, rescue some slaves, kill some slavers, and make an adamantine weapon, apparently. But before we do that, we're going to look around the Underdark, see if there's anywhere else I can go before I do that. Said so that like we're still on Namek. We've only been in the Underdark for two streams. This is the third stream. Why am I walking? Uh, okay. Uh, let's see, explosives. Here's here. That's an entrance to the Underdark. Um, we accidentally set off a fire trap over here, which burned the ladder, so we're not getting up there. You know what? Maybe we go back up and we fight those gnolls again. Now that we're all level 5. We might do a better, uh, better job this time. Okay... I guess there's nowhere else for us to go. I guess we're, uh... Can Karlak jump up the area with the ladder? That's a good question. Let's go find out. Uh, if I can remember where to go. Ah, here we are. Phasing into the floor. Oh, for fuck's sake. Wait, hang on. Storehouse, huh? Oh, we've got another bullet coming, don't we? Still alive, so that's progress. So Nicholas Cardelian rings. Can I climb over this? I have to move it out of the way. Cool. All right. What now? All right. Let's see what's in here. Start from the center in mercenaries and cutthroats. Useful friends if you can afford them. Are there mercenaries and cutthroats here, or? Oh, I was looking at the symbol. Okay. Take the rope. Torches don't need. Basic poison and wizard's bane oil. Cool. 
treasure. Alchemy. Torches. I wonder if you can mine. Huh. Ooh, four thieves tools. Nice. Whoops. Okay, that's something to attack. Got it. You know what? I'm going to have Karlak pick up that pickaxe, just in case. Wanna dance? Is that blood? No, never mind. Take the rope. Rustic chest. It's locked. Food. A kiwi, huh? Food. Sun melons. Ten camp supplies each. Nice. Silpanash sup. It's booze. Okay. Carafe of wine. Okay. Astarian. Trust no one. And bonus guidance. Total bonus 13 to 16. Literally more than the DC. Alright, don't roll a one, Lore. Okay, didn't roll a one, but it was close. Alright, what do we got here? Acid vials and alchemist fire. Cool. Let's move. Oh, poison, diluted oil of sharpness, poison, toxin. Uh, Starry, got another chest for you. Seventeen. I'm gonna get a thirty. I got. I rolled a thirty-two. For the head of the game, there was a DC zero check, and I saw a screenshot from somebody on Reddit who failed it. That's funny. Can't give up now. Oh, arrows. Elmater is necrotic damage. Prevent your target from regaining hit points. Darkness is spread magical darkness on impact. All right, back to Astarian. What to do? What's inside? Rotten banana in the fish barrel. Lovely. Bronze necklace? Who's making bronze necklaces? Arsonist oil. Coach your weapon in oil that transforms the target's fire resistance to fire vulnerability. Targets that are immune to fire damage are unaffected. More thieves tools. Cool. Uh, let's send those to um, Astarian. is trapped. Uh, okay. So the chest is trapped. Astarian, disarm the trap. Ooh, DC 15. And bonus guidance. Yeah, I'm gonna send some stuff from Meralda to the, uh, to the camp in a minute. Oh, right. Astorian has oh. to actually unlock the damn thing. <laughs> Whoops. With pleasure. It is a little annoying that you don't get EXP for unlocking and disarming stuff. 
Oh, he gets a bonus from uh, having bitten something in, in the last little while. Speak with that in false life. All right, Morelda. Elevator out of here. Ballot ale, rope. Rustic chest is probably locked. Yes, it is. Something good here, I hope. Yep, she's over encumbered. and accuracy. Potate, forget, carrot. More thieves tools. All right, what a historian. Unlock. God, rogue, uh, rogue the lock picking rolls are awesome. Shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times. A uh, short sword. Okay. Is that going to be better than? Um. My faith will guide me. Uh, then the dagger for not proficient with martial weapons or short swords. Damn. Okay. All's well that ends not as bad as it could have. Alchemy pouch. The alchemy pouches only weigh like fifteen pounds. Bark skin on uh, Morelda. Level one spell slot on Morelda. Uh, poison. We'll give the poison. We'll give the poison to a Starian. Wheel of sharpness. Uh, give that to Carlac. Of wine sent to camp. There's these emotion from the hag. Blackstaff sent to camp. Basic poison. Uh, we'll split that up. Three to each of the others. Well, no. Yeah, three to each of the others and two for Merelda. sure that that's working. Yes, okay. To Astorium, sent to Carlac, add some basic poison for Shadowheart. Uh, it goes to camp. Valor Ale goes to camp. Oh, there's grape. <laughs> it's the camp. Oh, Lord of Stone, it's in his kiss. If bank goes to camp. Or if bank goes to camp. Lost time, lover's avarice. Or Semper Icewine goes to camp. Missing 
pets. Oil of accuracy. Plus two bonus to attack rolls with the oiled weapon. Um, we'll send that to Carlac. Oil of diminution. Minus one penalty to damage, but target failing is constitution save. Suffer disadvantage on strength checks and save. Minus 1d4 penalty to melee damage. Uh, we'll send that to Astarian. Potion of Animal Speaking. Uh, keep that on Morelda. Potion of Glorious Vaulting. Uh, let's send that to Carlac. Potion of Greater Healing. Potion of Healing. Leaving that on Morelda. Potion of Invisibility. Uh, we'll leave that on Morelda for now. Potion of Sleep. Uh, okay. Uh, Potion of Vitality. Cures any poison or disease. We'll leave that on Morelda for now. Simple Toxin. Uh, okay. We'll split that up. Tonic, send a camp. Suspicious poison. I guess I'll just hold on to it. Sil Pashan Sup, send a camp. Go to dreams. Wizard's Bane Oil. I'm going to send that to. Hmm. I, huh, I'm going to send that to Astarian. Uh, Wyvern Toxin. Interactive weapon with Toxin that deals an additional 1 to 8 poison damage. A successful constitution saving throw target still takes half damage. Okay, we'll send one of those to Astarian and one of those to, um, Carlac. Uh, Basilisk Oil, we will keep a Morelda. Bitter Divorce. Uh, okay, we've got a million scrolls. Uh, Thieves Tools to Astarian. Okay. Corlon's Grace. Why have I not equipped this? Huh. I guess she'll equip that. Uh, Exterminator's Axe. I guess I will send to Carlac for now. That is a... Uh, that is a two-handed weapon. Okay. It's worse than what Carlac's wielding at the moment. Yeah, but uh, I will still hand it to her. Staff of the Moon Maiden. That wears. Keep the torch. Robe of Summer. The Absolute's Warboard. Uh, I'm going to send that to Shadowheart. Treasure. Linebreaker Boots. Once per turn, when you dash, you gain Wrath for two turns. Uh, uh, I think Karlak and Shadowheart have boots on. Soldier. Let's get on with it. Shadowheart does not have boots on. Okay. Time to rest. Alright, remind me to have her equip that. 
Uh, okay, with throw attacks and attacks made with improvised weapons. We'll give that to Karlak. Uh, Absolute's Talisman. If the wearer bears the Absolute's brand, they have advantage on death saving throws. Absolute's Talisman Aid. Level 2 Abjuration Spell. Um... Uh, Five healing. Heal yourself and increase your hit point maximum by five hit points. So here's the question about this. If I put this talisman on, cast its spell, and then take the talisman off, do I keep the maximum hit point bonus? That seems a little cheap. Like, I could just pass that around to everyone. once per long rest and they would all get five extra max hit points uh beast master shade and well friendship we'll keep it uh treasure 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 uh lightning blast for lightning charges all right lightning blast to strike the next lightning spell or cantrip your next lightning spell or ketchup gives additional lightning damage equal to your remaining lightning charges. Well, that's really only useful on Moralda. Good chance the Perlong Rest is tied to the item. Okay. Books. Books. All right, Goblin's Drawing, which has an orange border, which makes me think it's a quest item. So I will hang on to that. We don't need the rancid note anymore. Adamantine force, that's the name of it. Okay, Selenite right. We'll hang on to that. Selenite journal. That's just a hint to the puzzle. Selenite prayer sheet. Implement orders. Oh, I never figured out where, what this was about, huh? of Grim Forge.
Okay, we'll hang on to that. Alright, acid vials are grenades. Agatha's treasure. Fish head is uh Alchemist Fire are grenades. Uh Blue Cap is camp supplies. Caustic bulb is a grenade. Uh, Corget is food. Dried saucers leaks is food. Eldritch rune. I still don't know what to do with that. Fish is food. Fish is food. A little slime bomb is a grenade. Trigger to focus stew is food. Food. Grace bottles, I'll keep on her. Head of a broken spear. Uh, I see crystal. I don't know what to do with that. I see helve. I see metal. Oh, it has combined. Morning Frost. Morning Frost. Uh, it is a quarterstaff, 2 to 12 damage. Uh, when dealing cold damage, the wheeler deals an additional 1 cold damage. Dealing cold damage with a spell possibly inflicts chilled upon the target. Oh, it comes with Ray of Frost. What is chilled? Affected entity is vulnerable to cold damage and resistant to fire damage. Interesting. Okay. Well, that's cool. Alright, memory shard we're hanging on to. These are the Mind Flayer Parasites, Mortar and Pestle, Mysterious Artifact, Pear, Sinto Camp. Was a slime bomb potato sent to camp? Purple fluoride shard, red apple sent to camp. Crushes balls, smoke powder satchel is a grenade, spiked bulb is a grenade. Avian cheese wheel sent to camp. Water I'll hang on to, void bulb is a grenade. To teapot I'm keeping forever. The necromancy of Tay. It is not too late. Uh, supply packs sent to camp. Supply packs sent to camp. And water melons sent to camp. Alright, how much weight am I carrying now? 119 of 240. Okay, that only... That dropped about 80 pounds of weight, which is less than I was hoping, but... Um, hey, it's something. Alright, before we go up here, we are going to save... Then we'll see where this elevator takes us. Doesn't work. Can't use this right now. Okay. Is there a lever? Okay, maybe I can only come down from above. Alright. Does not cost. Uh, oh, right, it's a cantrip. Well, cool. Okay. I'll put my uh, regular amulet, amulet back on. Oh, it only lasts for as long as you're wearing the amulet. Okay. Well, fair enough. What am I doing? I can just teleport away. Okay. So I don't see anything except the Arcane Tower and the Adamantine Forge. I 
Okay. Let's go. To the Adamantine Forge. Where we can kill some slavers. Uh, let's check spell slots. Oh. Uh, we're going to take a long rest and then we will go to the Adamantine Forge. Because we can, we can only take one long rest in there before um, we run out of time on certain quests. So... Don't have enough camp supplies. Oh, it's because I put it all in the camp chest. Okay, so it doesn't draw from the camp chest. Where is the camp chest? Ah, here it is. I just pulled out a... Huh. Got anything they want to talk about? Doesn't look like it. All right. Man, those are not comfortable bed rolls. Awesome. You got anything new to say? You wish to speak? You're still faring well at camp, I hope. With such stimulating company? <laughs> Never better. I'm taken. Uh, all right. Leave camp. Okay, he off, uh, detect thoughts. Speak with animals. Let's get going. Let's do it. Uh, save now that I've applied those effects, just in case I need to load later. on the lake's murky waters. Sail into the darkness. have to fight a cave fish monster. Oh, no, nope, another ship is coming up on us. Elf, what are you doing on Gex Raft? <laughs> Why 
Where's Gek? Who are you? Your doom. Push the Dwergar into the water. <laughs> that would be pretty funny. I might do that. These guys are slavers. I, I'm going to kill them. I'm afraid Gek is dead. He fell fighting the Mykonids. DC 15. Whew. That was close. Damn. The sergeant will be pissed about her boots. That's the thing you took away from that? Come on. Let's get you to shore. You're the one telling the sergeant what happened. The rest of you, keep patrolling. I'll be heading back with this one. You continue forward in silence until the lights of a camp twinkle through the murk. Okay, so the plan is to fuck up all the slavers, um, free the slaves, take them back with us on the boat, who's that? Is that Char? I think I remember this being a Char forge. Sideways. We've got a welcoming party. You shithead! Time you showed up. We got trouble. Spit it out. Sergeant finally choked on true soul near's prick. Rubno! The twat soul caused a rockfall. Trapped tighter than a ring on a fat finger. Ha! <laughs> You're shitting me. You pay up? That's the trouble. He's got the gold on him. Sergeant's arm is falling off with all the gnome slaves she's been beating. Who's the whom, Grayman? Another slave for the dig. I am a true soul, and you will treat me with respect. That's so. I... You feel the slightest of stirrings in your head. The Dwergar is not infected, yet your minds resonate. Oh, I'll be... You ain't shitting. Felt the tingle. Your twat soul chum owes us a load of coin. You want through... Make a donation. A hundred gold is... is... nothing. And I want to see what's going on in here before I start killing everybody. But make no mistake, killing everybody is going to happen. Fine, take it. I'll be shagged to Shanatar. Shit's luck. I'll get that back from your body in a I'm bit. I'm warning you. That twat soul ain't settled up soon. There'll be hell to pay for the lot of you cult buggers. Only Astario got XP for that. Are we full up on inspiration again? Huh. Did I lose detect thoughts? Why don't I have detect thoughts? Okay. Looting this place would be stealing, and that would bring them down on me. 
Go on. Yeah, fine. Okay, let's see what's in here. Talk to Nier, then murder our way out. I think. Hiss? What's making a hissing noise? Oh, spoders. Gods. All these drow. Someone's trying to send a message. Don't like strangers here. But Absolute must have took you in. Who hung these drow out to, the dr out to dry? Me? Who else? My spiders sussed them out of hiding. Then near taught them a thing or two, and I let them fly. Where did the drow come from? Caught them sniffing around. Easy marks. Had the stench of the toplands. Hung them here as a warning. Ain't no one drooks with clan flame shade. Present company excluded, of course. Oh, hush you. Stop fishing for compliments. They're starting to rot. You've got a brain of your own. Use it. Oh no. Is this all the gnome slaves? Did I take too long? Unless you're here to kick some stiffs lakeside, I suggest you bugger off. <laughs> Grim work. Did you kill them? Nah. Rockfall smashed them. Can't have them stinking up the place. <laughs> The half that weren't crushed are digging the true soul out Okay, of the there are still some alive. Okay, let me look at this map. Uh, oh, I passed a waypoint. Cool. Talk to Sergeant Thrym. Free the Deep Gnomes. Kill Deer. What's this? Reach the Adamantine Forge. Okay. Locked. Okay. What's that? How about How about I chop off your Hmm, what's that? A button. Let's press it. What do we have in here? A collapsed archway is something I can fit through with gaseous form, I'll bet. Oh. Hello. There's pig, hey. Arkin's horde, so, gold. Are you greeting invisible beings? Or just losing your mind. <laughs> the echoes, listen. They're coming from three directions. Losing your mind it is. Probably the tadpole. The weirdest things seem to be. Okay. Let's talk to these assholes up here. Stick shit. It's stick pick, you piss pot. That's what I said. Stick shit. My mug's gone dry, stick shit. You heard her, stick shit. Fill her up. Another hour, stick shit. <laughs> piss pot. You flirt. Now jump to it. Or it's up to the lift, and straight to the shadows. Cruelty like that poisons the soul. Till one day, you drop dead. Or well, the person you're fucking with snaps and puts a sword in your eye. Bet there's lots of people True you wish could put uh, swords in eyes, Carlac. We won't move a pebble. 
I heard a true soul was trapped. Should you be helping? Hold out your hands, Oon. You heard the man. Let's see him. You want to see my hands? What for? Less our skin, more showing. Fine, take a look. Five working fingers. Nice and bony. Prime for digging. You want there? You claw him out. My drinking hand's busy. Hey! Stick shit! Where's my drink? Coming right up, piss pot. Stick shit? Talks like smug. And he wrecked that shroom village. And then shagged it. <laughs> Here's to smug, nasty prick. Bet he's one of the corpses that got fogified. Rot iron gate. Shit. You got one of Nair's moon lanterns, Jacques. A moon lantern? What's that? Well, uh, pixie lamps. If you're headed to Moonrise, you won't last without it. Oh, is that how we get through the shadow? Top lands are clogged with the death dark. Choke you in no time. Uh, thanks for sharing. I'll keep it in mind. Go on. Get some air. But don't go cursing me if that shadow shit snuffs you. If the cure's in Moonrise, we should go. Near and his lantern be damned. After all, shadows will be the least of our worries if we start to turn. Oh, you can actually see Astarian's bite scars on... Um... On his neck. I never noticed that before. The moon lantern is key to our survival. That means freeing near. Agreed. Next stop, near. Astarian disapproves, of course. All right, so that leads us to Moonrise. That's just a bunch of spoders. Uh, Karlak, speak with animals. I speak true, brothers. You know it in your hearts. You know it in your very souls. We need no lolf. No spider queen. Father Murmuth is the head of Clan Lur. He hatched us, raised us. Is this a spider us. evangelist? Care we for his business here? He keeps us small, keeps us contained. We should be with the spider queen, revered, adored. Recall your learnings about the spider queen, Loth. Oh, she gets a minus one for it. Okay. Oh, come on. Yeah, I'll use inspiration. Are you fucking with me? Nothing in particular comes to mind. Father Mermuth is our past. Lolf is our future. These spiders are loyal to the local Dwergar. In the event of a fight, they will join the fray against you with slavering enthusiasm. Oh, I can make them think that uh, Mermuth hates them. Sure, let's roll deception. Mermath, is that the guy who keeps telling everyone about his useless, hideous spiders? DC 10. Are you fucking with me? I'll, I'll roll that again. Oh my god. Oh my god, I even got max guidance roll. He doesn't know our true potential, our true splendor. Only Loth knows that. Ungrateful, traitorous, undeserving.
Well, that's one less spider to worry about, I guess. Stinking snitch. No one drugs with clan flame sight. Looking ahead. Right, let's get out of here before he thinks we killed his spoder. There's what a shopkeep the over here. Is doing in the underdog. Reinforcements, huh? Let's see how long you last. Come into her shadow. Let all that is past be forgotten. Kip, if I wasted two inspiration on all that. Focus with you breathing so close. How peculiar. Smooth face, cobbled edges. They're a sign. They must be. Sign of what? A sun dweller in these parts. Look here, my topside friend. I need fresh eyes, and I doubt I'll find fresher. A friendly welcome, a rarity in the Underdark. As rare as a smile in Shindlerin, you might say. But I've no skill for slaving. I prefer chisel to cane. Well, hopefully we don't have to kill you later. But these learned eyes reach their limits. And so I must humbly request yours. What do you think I can do? Fine, what should I be looking at? Uh, what are you doing exactly? Peering into cracks and crevices in hope to find history's morsels. I have come up regrettably short. I hope you might see truths where I cannot. Fine. What should I be looking at? The rock. The rubble. All of it, if I may be so bold. Take a look. Tell me what you see. And be thorough. Ah. Uh... Assess the statue for technique and composition. Guidance. Total bonus seven to ten. Okay. Whew. The statue's meandering curves and golden edges stand out against the weathered masonry behind it. Two styles, two eras. The statue was carved from newer stone and erected by latecomers to this ancient fortress. Anything standing out? Uh, examine the fallen rubble. Okay, got it. and stone bricks of various sizes clutter the corridor. Many split cleanly in two. Yet some walls remain fully intact. No quake brought these rocks down. They were smashed through in an instant. Something big charged through here. Something very big. Probably that magma guardian. What do you think? And Perception. Survey the area for unseen curiosities. Okay, got it. Several glassy stones stand out in the debris. They look Their melted. Are coated with tiny yellow crystals. The hottest of flames smoothed the stone and yep, definitely the magma guardian. Behind. The fires of the hells have touched Grimforge. I'm ready to report my observations. Incredible. An entire history risen from dirt and debris. Picture it. An ancient city hewn from the stone by disciples of Shah, later abandoned. Untold centuries later, a new tribe revives it. Fresh walls, fresh sculptures. Pretty cool. Until a great hell beast charges through, toppling the walls and crushing the people. Oh, that explains the infernal plate I found. Ooh. Perhaps you might have use of it. Hell yeah. 
Another piece for Karlak. But my work has only begun. There is more still to find. I must get to it. I would like to trade. Well, let's see what you've got. All right, what do you have? Scroll of Confusion. 432. Stone Skin. Blink. Remove Curse. Enlarge. Elmater, Roaring Thunder. An additional level 2 spell slot. Ooh, okay. I'll buy that. I'll take the fire resist potions for when I want to uh, interact with Karlak. Peerless Focus. Advantage on con saves and against being charmed. Magic can't put you to sleep. Irrelevant. Replaces effects from other elixirs when drunk. Oh, maybe I give that to Karlak. Uh, okay. Confusion. Uh. Stone skin. Confusion and stone skin are... Are those level four spells? I could learn Blink. I huh. Yep, he did give me another infernal alloy. Oh, infernal alloy, infernal iron. Okay, so different pieces. Much of River High Scroll 720. There's Featherfall. Arrow of Acid is 5 to 18 damage. Potion of Mind Reading. Ooh. Cool. I like the Potion of Mind Reading. Not that I need it, but... Alright, we'll hold off on buying those spells. Ruin has a story to tell. That much is true, at least. The most I'll give you one thing. You've got a keen eye. Uh, even sharks have their uses. Don't be shy. Tired. Sleep. Rest, little one. But do not take long. I feel his shadow. Whose shadow? I heard his name whispered. The rock shivers from the sound. The Catherick Thorm. Catherick Thorm, a familiar name. Halsen mentioned his stronghold deep underground. Do you mean Catherick Thorm, the Dark Justicia commander? Mm. Mighty elf. Cloaked in darkness, ten masters ago, and ten more. But I remember there was the work. How old are you? And the blood. There was the Thorm's army. There was the hell beast that broke them. The Catherick Thorm's name faded into stone. Until the near came. Uh, I 
impressive memory. How old are you exactly? I outlived my mother, and her mother's mother, and many mothers beyond. Blessed to see many live. Cursed. You are a to pretty intelligent beast. Die. Uh, Hellbeast, you mean like me? Hordes? No. Bigger. Angrier. Okay, so we're gonna have to fight a I demon when we get there. and flesh. Smelled fire and eggs. Were the eggs cooking it in the fire? with the mask men. Crashing and smashing. Do eggs have a smell? I mean, rotten eggs do, but do do regular eggs have a smell? That was a long time ago. What does Nier have to do with Ketherick? I know not, so I say not. Yet I hear his name again, said by the shadows. I've got a long road ahead. Rotten eggs are often said to smell like sulfur. Okay, so it smelled like rotten eggs. Damaged dark justicia armor. 13 AC. Let's see what uh, Shadowheart has to say about that. One gill, potion of speed. Dark, dis dark Justicia Mail. While obscured by shadow, the wearer deals 1 to 4 necrotic damage to attackers that hit them with a melee attack. Interesting. And it would remove the disadvantage on stealth checks, but... Minus 1 armor class. Dark Justicia's Journal. Cycle 40. I know it is forbidden to enter the Inquisitor's chambers, but I could not help myself. Has Master Ketherick not commanded us to use every possible tool to best Shar's rivals? Besides, if Sybil meant to keep the amulet a secret, she would have hidden it better. Cycle 40 and 2. The amulet has gifted me a power and energy heretofore unknown to me. I've never known such might and such cheer. I could barely keep myself from smiling, much to the other's chagrin. So I fiffin. Ha! I ha 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 Cycle 40 and 5. It is done, thank the Dark Lady. Sybil ripped the amulet from my throat and cast it into the lava, having found me racked by laughter. The madness has lifted, but I do not yet know my penance. Sybil is not known to take pity on thieves. Help the spirit of the amulet. As you look at the skeletons, you realize they are all clad in the same dark armor. You immediately recognize the symbol of your lady. You know these uniforms. These people were dark justicius, an honorary order within the priesthood of Shah. Something powerful killed them. We must be careful. Agreed. Let's go. We have places to be. All the Dr. Stishers. Also said they once had a stronghold down here. Cool. We'll leave the scale armor on for now. Kill. Wonder how much of this place we get to explore. Because there are layers. You grab a cane and whip these droogning beasts into shape. That rubble needs clearing. And my patience is hanging on by an arse whisker. Do your own dirty work. Don't think I won't thrash you harder than the Roth, eh? Something spooks the dumb shits. 
So stop your join and get to working. What's behind the rubble? You got no need to know, and I got no need to tell. So get to caning or to leaving. Examine the rubble for anything unusual. Guidance. D oh, only DC5. All right. Cool. A slight glint catches your eye. Focus on the glint. I have to roll again for that? Your eye finds the source of the gleam. A small mote of black metal. Adamantine. I know what you're after. There's adamantine back there, isn't there? Stuff's no joke. Stronger than steel. Rarer than mithril. It ain't mined. It's made. There's an adamantine forge back there, sure as shitting. Don't get any smart ideas. That forge is clan property. But get the beasts moving and I'll toss some coin your way. Uh, if I say, let's see what I can do. Um, no, I'm not going to say, let's see what I can do, because it might make me cane the beasts. I'm going to have Karlak talk to them. Just splitting, then. Sue your damn self. No more. No more pain. No more work. All must die. Breathe, focus. If you strike, your masters will destroy the herd. Is true. Oh, man. I'm gonna kill the Dwergar and save them. So I'm gonna tell her to calm down. Breathe, focus. If you strike, your masters will destroy the herd. DC 10. All right. We will work. We will do as we're told. We will clear the way. I'll be back to save you in a bit. feel bad about this. What the hells? I helped you. Now you want me dead? There's an adamantine forge back there, Sharg. And I'm not the sharing type. Bloody Rose, they have lost it. Put him down! For fuck's sake. All right. Hopefully this doesn't spread to the rest of the building. That did 25 damage. Nice. Hunter's Mark. What does Hunter's Mark do? That's just a ranger thing, I believe. I'll save my uh, level 3 spell. All right, how much HP do you have? Eight. Uh, let's firebolt him, see if that kills. It missed, of course. My turn. Uh, let's kill Grundle. 
Use one of our rage charges for the day. The hammer's gonna fall. I wonder if this is worth the cost. Okay. Work on Morgia. Saved Wounding Ray. I forget what bonus effect Wounding Ray has. Oh, she's a Barbie. All right. Miss. Nice. Uh... Do not react. I'll save my luck charges. Holy shit! Well, I used a couple, up a couple of my luck charges, but uh, Morel is in trouble. If I kill Morgia, that'll free up Carlac. Uh, no. Can I should dash? Attack this guy. Oh, I got sneak attack too. Awesome. Twenty-three damage. Not bad. Can't give up. Uh. I've only got two level three spell slots. Inflict wounds as a level one spell. Seventeen damage. Nice. I got this. Five damage. Oh, she's raging. Right. I am frightened. Oh, great. I'm threatened as well, so I can't... I could disengage as a bonus action. I'm immobilized. Okay. Misty Step is a level 2 spell. Let's use a regular ass heal potion. And I should have... Bone chill. Come on. Miss, come on. Nice miss. Nice miss. Starion. Two HP. We've got it. Got him. Now this is my happy place. <laughs> well, so much for peace. Uh, firebolt. Missing, all right. With pleasure. Uh, 
Got him. Nice. All right. Gold, arsenic oil. We have mushroom. Gold. We have mushroom. Whipping cane. I think I'll pass. Gold shield. Copper ring. Dark ring. Adamantine slag. Small damage should be of any use. All right. Are those specks of adamantine in this slag? Uh, all right. Carlac. Dwegar can't hurt anymore. We'll wait until it's safe to leave. What about the other one? Grey one's gone. Good. We'll stay here until it's safe to leave. Where could you go? All right, well. At least things have stayed interesting. Uh. Hmm. Shut up, Art. Let's see what's in the forge. I hope that guardian isn't in here. Starium. I'll take the guidance bonus just in case. Well, it doesn't matter. Got it. Just gonna not roll a one. My Bethesda brain is complaining. A trap. Someone doesn't like visitors. That I'm not getting EXP for disarming traps and picking locks. Ooh, DC fifteen. Ooh, just barely. There's another one up here. Oh dear. It's a ladder. To trap out for us. Okay.
We're real dungeon delvers now. Disarming traps every five feet. Traps. How considerate. Oh dear. Someone's left a trap out for us. Ah, oh, balls. Try it again. Got it. Okay. Got it. Got it. Don't walk over that, Carlac. Okay, we've got enough. Damn it, Shadow Heart. This shuts it off. It did not shut it off. Damn. Okay. Over here. Well, well, well. Oh no! A starian's in the way now. And we're all prone. All team members are incapacitated. Damn it, we, we did so well. God damn it. Okay.
All right, well, let's try it again. A trap. Someone doesn't like visitors. All right, first, let's look over here. Orb of Dark Vision. Oh, that's a familiar feeling. Darkness and loss. Be careful. There are traps about. This will be fun. There's another one. Could leap over there with Carlac. Uh, no, we're gonna. All right, disarmed. Oh dear! Someone's left a trap out. Awesome. The incense is a gill. Incense. Incense, incense, okay. Traps, how considerate. I should, uh, I should split a star eight off from everybody else so Shadowheart doesn't trigger the trap again. I need Is that blood? the others that to blood? perceive this. Step carefully. There's a trap. I rolled fuck. There are traps about. Okay, the trap at the very end has not turned on. Uh, let's see if I can... down there me there is work to do need to keep going okay it shut off cool oh dear someone's left a trap out for us how delicious Behind 
let's get going. Making me sweat. All right, it turns back on. What now? No time to rest. All right, back to Astarian. Careful, I'm behind. Disarm this. Got it. All's well that ends not as bad as it could have. Disarm this, just to be thorough. Succeed. Okay. Easy. Detected the trap. Oh no! The thing at the end. Keep a blade close. It's gonna. It's gonna burn us. Ah, oh, crap. Okay. I think we're going to have to try again. Because we triggered the trap at the end. This is frustrating. Astarian, you're up. Keep your distance, darling. Ninety, nice. A trap. Someone doesn't like visitors. 
Well, again. And again. Be careful. There are traps about. Right, go around. Nineteen. Awesome. Everybody else up to detect the other traps in this specific spot. Guidance, roll. Cool. What perception did I just fail? Skeleton here. What's a skeleton got? Oh, iron key. Probably to the gate at the end of this. Human, certainly. A god, perhaps. Why would gnomes make such a thing? Why don't you tell me? Okay, end of the conversation. Okay, okay. Didn't roll a one. Good. We're already further th th than we were last time. All right, failed perception checks. Everything, despite everything. Step carefully. There's a trap. All right, get guidance back. Got it. Okay. Okay, got it. Only a couple traps left to disarm. C10. Got it. Traps. How considerate. All right, roll. Got it.
Okay, that key was not to this gate. Lock picking impossible. All right. Oh, there's something in there. And there's a chest behind it. Try clicking on the characters a bunch. Uh, no. True RTS fashion, they have a bunch of joke uh, click lines. Starion, one last trap for you. Bonus guidance. Oh, it's DC 10. Awesome. Got it. So, by that, do you mean swapping between the characters or trying to talk to them? Can't afford to stay idle. Whatever comes. I'm ready. I'm ready. What's next, I wonder? My face protects me. What am I to do? I'm ready. Whatever it takes. Wits and blades always sharp. There's no time to waste. A long way to go still. Have to keep focused. Can't afford to get attached. To anyone. I'm not getting any new lines. Could go for a good meal. No time to dally. There is work to do. I'm ready. Wits and blades always sharp. Okay, it's repeating. Let's march. Damn, it's good to be alive. Don't be shy. Soldier. Attention. Oh, I could go for a good meal. Uh, let's re-equip her with her good weapon. Incense, 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 gill. Silver glass passes the vodka line. More gill. The Protecty Sparks Wall. There's a hell of a name. High spell casting. You gain a plus one bonus to spell save DC. The wearer has a plus one bonus to armor class and saving throws as long as they have lightning charges. Ooh! Okay, more Astarian gear! Uh, Elixir of Bark Skin. Elixir of Vigilance. Elixir of Poison Resist. What is she wearing? Grants resistance to cold damage. Okay. What is he wearing for armor? Oh. All right, protecty. Minus 
four AC. So the only benefit here is, um, is a bonus to save plus one bonus to saving throughs at the cost of minus three AC. Maybe if it were plus one bonus to AC per lightning charge, I'd use it, but. Huh. Shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times. Uh, plus one bonus to spell save DC. been really good for Merelda if you had picked up that lightning charge staff, but you picked a lightning bow instead. Yeah, fair enough. Uh, this will give Merelda a plus one bonus to spell save DC. Do I swap resistance to cold damage for plus one bonus to spell save DC? I haven't been taking cold damage. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do it. And it's blue, my favorite color. Lever, huh? Idol of Shar. Ooh. One gill. All right. Okay. My face Not a heart. Me. Uh, where's that lever? I don't know what that did. Oh, it probably uh, it probably triggers the trap, doesn't it? An idol of Lady Shaw. It's beautiful. Curious that I found it. Not the first sign of the Dark Lady's power that I've encountered. Idol of Shara is a very funny interaction if you're a cleric of Saluda, I'll bet. No one uh, we have something to talk to uh, Shadowheart about now. That drow, near is going to be on his last gasp unless someone digs him out. Though, not necessarily our concern, of course. You kept that Idol of Shara from Grimfo Grimforge? I take it? Of course. I couldn't leave such a treasure behind. I'll find it a place of honor in the camp. I suppose I owe you my thanks. Unlikely I'd have found this without you leading the way. In any case, it was certainly not what I expected to find in the Underdark. I wonder... Perhaps this is connected to the Dark Justicius. This is no coincidence, I'm sure of it. I need to keep an eye out for more signs. Learn more about the Justicius presence in these lands. It could be important. As long as I've prayed to Lady Shah, I've wished to serve her as a dark justice. I'll bet you've only had that desire since you got your mind wiped. You dedicate yourself to Lady Shah, save perhaps if you become the head of her church. If Dr. Justicius were once a power around here, all signs suggest that time has long passed. All signs we've encountered so far, perhaps. I'll be keeping my eyes peeled going forward. Well, oh, cool. Okay. Uh, let's lower that switch again. Alright, before we go down there... Oh, that has levers. Interesting. Okay. I see something with spider webs on it. Huh. All right. We'll probably get ambushed by spiders when we go over there. Mm. 
Heavy chest is probably locked. It is not. Okay, gold mirror image. Maybe something opens up down there if I throw this switch. Maybe it just arms traps, I don't know. Doesn't look like anything opened up. So what happens with the idol of Shar if you're a cleric of Saluna? Gill, potion of speed. Uh, I will give that potion of speed to Carlac. All right, let's see what these levers do. Lift that up. If you're romancing Shadowheart, you can give it to her and she's distrustful of it. But then one of your dialogue options is just kiss me like you hate me. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'm going to decouple Karlak from the party. Have her get on this. And then throw this switch. What's the story? All right, let's see what's over here. Yeah, we'll go up the ladder. Oh, this is how we get over here. Right, blast mines. This place is hungry for blood. Those are tracks. Footprints. Where do they lead? Down into the water, it seems. Bloody tracks. And shackles. And arrows. Someone barely got out of here with their life. Bloody tracks okay. and shackles and arrows. Somebody Some dove into the water, it seems. Interesting. Okay. The 
Much like the Lego Batman movie, it's so black robe that I legitimately wonder if the people who run it are Homestucks. Homestuck has had such a massive impact on um, on pop culture, hasn't it? It's wild to think about just, oh hey, a plaque, just how much it's affected everything. Come, all who are weary, sleep and forget. And forget, that's all it is. Okay, we need to leave somebody behind to go this way. Let's head into the dorm, see what we can find in there. Oh, this is what the iron key was for. Wait, hang on. Karlak can probably make these jumps. How far can Carlac jump? Okay, maybe I give Carlac a jumping potion. I want the whole party together for this. Looking ahead. Triples jumping distance. Whole party can make those jumps? Well... No, it's too far. So everybody else is going to get... Um, is going to get on this thing. And Carlac will drink a jumping potion. Have a lot on my mind. And, well, in it. What's cooking? I did buy the jumping potion, right? Glorious vaulting. <laughs> nice. see what's in here. Books. Roll of books. Everett's Black Tentacles. Tentacles sprout from the ground, turning the area into difficult terrain, attacking and smothering creatures within. And Dark Vision. Shard Inquisitor. Harper Key. Undelivered Letter. Master Catherick, my whip has finally coaxed some particulars from the captive Harper. To wit, she revealed the location of her stockpile on a rocky overlook. I investigated, but found the chest in question is trapped, and the attempt to open it might break its contents completely. The spy refuses to reveal how to open the chest, even under threat of death, only crying, Lux Splenda, with every lash. Some type of watchword, no doubt. The interrogation continues. 
And again, please accept my most humble apologies for my earlier oversights. Rest assured, I will not misidentify any more of my fellow Sharans as spies. May they walk forever in shadow. What was that watchword? Lux Splenda. Lux Splenda. Give a light spell a try. That should get us into that chest. All right, well, let's find a... Thank you. Let's find this chest, I guess. Scroll the fireball and mirror image. Scorching ray. Whoops, didn't mean to sit. I meant to talk to the skeleton. There's a specific game-breaking bug slash oversight with this chest. All right, what is it? Do I know the light spell? That's something clerics get, right? No time to dally. Fear of wolves. And heart scalp prickles with fear when she encounters wolves. If she steps within 30 feet of a lupine creature, she must take a wisdom saving throw or become frightened. Oh, I haven't looked at all their characteristics. There's all sorts of cool stuff here, huh? Uh, acolyte, proficiency and insight in religion. Domain spells. Gain spells from your domain, they are always prepared. Civil militia. Probably is someone who was abducted by the Sharans. Fey ancestry. Destroy undead. Okay. Uh, where's. Oh, spellbook is something different. Spellbook. Uh, okay, always available spells. Charm, disguise, mirror, pass. Bestow curse, fear, church resistance, guidance, sacred flame, produce flame. She does not know the light spell. Or no, maybe she does. Prepare spells. Okay, yeah. Using an item is a free action. You don't need to use an action to do it. Attempting to open a trapped chest is just such a free action. So you can give yourself a buff that makes you immune to the trap's damage. And then use the trap repeatedly. Ah. Well, we're going to do it the intended way. Faith, bane, bless, command, create or destroy, protection from evil and good. Okay. Okay. All right. Does what Morelda now? know the light spell? No. I think I have a scroll of light in my inventory, at least. Blur, burning hands, cloud of daggers, fog cloud, fly, fireball, feign death, feather fall, false life, efforts by tentacles, dimension door, detect thoughts. No, 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 no. No, 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 oh, okay. Wait, hang on. What am I to do? She gets the daylight spell. No, she doesn't. Merelda no does. To live in more interesting times. No, wait. Who did? I'm ready. Whatever it takes.
daylight. Would that count for the chest? I guess we'll find out. Now we gotta find this chest. No one back home will ever believe this. These are Sharon weapons. I would recognize the Night Singer's blades anywhere. Uh. There's fire and arrows. What's that dripping? Dripping acid from above. All right. Tarnished silver key. Getting lots of keys today. All right. Shield mold. Ah ha ha Steel mold. Used in forges to cast armor and weapons. We give that to Carlax so she can carry it. Where are you? There you are. That's for the forge. If we can get some mithril. What? Oh, what did we find in here? Hell's bore. This is a... Maragon Legionnaire. These hell spawn. Okay. All right. So let's start with the Starion. I should have known there'd be an encounter in here. To the death. Got it. Okay. You out of the way of the door. Nothing will stand in my way. Move you into the room. Hell's bore. 19 HP. Probably resists fire. Lock charge. Do not react. How's more turned into a pile of ash? Okay. Have to keep going. <sighs> All right. Guiding bolt. Level one. Miss again. All right. Harrowing thunder. Wait, I didn't get missile snaring? Crit miss. All right. Nice. Wait, why is Shadowheart back out here? All right. That's weird. Uh, all right. Use... One of today's rage charges. I should have done that. Oh well. Too late now. Ready for this. Okay, can I actually dash? One shot it. We one shot it. Good. 
have no choice but to keep going. Uh, well, we might as well use the melee attack with my new cold staff. Never mind. Damage, all right. All right, bye, Meralda. All right, let's finish this bastard off. Got him, okay. What is this debuff on Karlak? Oh, they're burning, okay. Alright, let's get Merelda up. What a charmer. Miracle and Halberd. 6 to 15 damage. Weapon enchantment plus 1. Alright, well, it'll sell. Devil Foil Mask. The mask's interior is lined with jagged bite marks. A single notch indicating the rank of foot soldier. The facade bears only an innocent smile and wide, searching eyes, seeking its own kind. Strange mask. Looks familiar, but I can't quite place it. I'd know it anywhere. It's a Maragon's mask. Infernal warriors. Oh, Fire Stoker Crossbow. Deals an additional 1 to 4 piercing damage to burning targets. Okay. So the 6 skill, Bronze Goblet, is worth money. Scroll of Vampiric Touch. Looking ahead. Uh, okay. Uh, let's short rest. Feeling fresh. And use a healing potion. Is that a relief of Shar? Bet there's something on the other side of that. Alright, Shadowheart. Even the candles are black. Another mask. A Maragorn's mask, no less. Those infernal soldiers only fight with the commander at their side. And I don't see one here. Uh, rusted key. Might be useful. Old letter. Sybil, my scouts bring me troubling word that Moonhaven yet stands. Have you forgotten the three laws of robotics? Would you turn your back on Mistress Shar? Tonight, you will beg Shar's forgiveness. Tomorrow, I depart Moonrise Towers for Grimforge. A ten day hence, I shall march the Dark Justiciers to Moonhaven myself. By the time the first star trembles that night, the Selenites shall be slain and their allies routed. Speak your prayer thrice nightly, Sybil. Once at nightfall, once at moon's zenith, and once before sunrise. I shall remind you the words, lest you've forgotten. Mistress Shar, I have glorified your name. Master Thorm, I have cried out your word. I am your servant forevermore. Demonstrate your devotion, and Shar may still know you. Fail, and you are naught but dust, unknown and unremembered. Your master, Catherick Thorm. Elixir of Fire, Ez. Still alive, so that's progress. For the sexy times. Ochre jelly? Oh, it's a thing in the brazier. Okay. Nothing in the hellbore ash. Okay, that's everything around here. Gotta find that chest on a rocky crag, huh? Okay. 
Now let's head this away. This is a little unnerving. Let's save. Oh, there's a chest. Dark Justicia Helm. Swathed in shadow. Well, obscured by shadow, the wearer gains plus one to saving throws when attacked. And Constitution saving throws plus one. Oh, all right. Well, you're not going to wear it, but I'll let you pick this up, uh, Shadowheart. All's well that ends not as bad as it could have. Map of Moonhaven. This war map offers a detailed plan to attack the village of Moonhaven, encouraging soldiers to kill in merciless silence. Uh, okay. Astarian. Well, hello. Gill, a gold ingot. Oil of accuracy and basic poison. Okay. What's this plaque say? Another scrying eye. In the beginning the came had. morning, then Someone's night. Watching. Oh, yeah, scrying Two eye. Two sisters clashed. It's not one dark scary. and one light. All right, where the hell are we on the map? Let's wait to move rise towers. What's this? Oh, there's the Harper stash. Okay. This is... Find the Lost Amulet. Help the spirit of the amulet. Adamantine Forge. Sergeant Thrym. Free the Deep Gnomes. Kill Deer. Okay. Can't give up now. Hanging out above lava. All right. Levers. More levers. Okay. Scimitar mold. Garlac, pick that up. Come on, let's go. She is not over encumbered. All right. What do these levers do? Ah, I see. Raises that up. And what's this one do? Okay, gotta leave somebody behind here to do this. Huh. That's a long trek back. This is this is a pain in the ass. Okay. Okay. We will leave Lorelda here. Okay. How are we going to go about this? Because this is going to be a real pain in the ass. Yep, there's that scry guy. Uh, oh. I lost detect thoughts. 
Egal. Alright, this is going to be a pain in the ass to wrangle. Uh, so before I split the party, Minda, am I correct in that I got to leave somebody here to operate this uh, and bring somebody else around? Um, and get on this platform? So I've got to leave somebody behind. Took this whole thing from a completely different angle so you didn't deal with it. Oh, okay. Uh, Alright, well, Merelda, stick around. Uh, Astarian and Karlak. No, we'll take the whole crew. Oh, you can shoot the arrows? You, you can shoot the levers with an arrow? Oh. Well, shoot. Merelda, come on. Let's test that. What's that? Right, everybody here. Oh, hey, a mold, long sword mold. Hey, good looking. She is not over encumbered yet. Good. Careful, I bind. Oh! Well, that's significantly easier. All right. Gil, very nice. That's going to drop my HP? Alright. See if I can jump up. I can. Okay. Lovely. Held together by rust and hope. Garlac? Garlac. Making me sweat. Oh, get back up here, idiots. Merelda, come on. Darian, shoot that one.
That's a bit of a drop. All right. A starry and a shoot. This one. Okay, we all made it. Now what? Oh, there's another mold. All right. Now what? There's a waypoint there. Oh, I can jump here. Waypoint acquired. I like pick up this mold. Base mold. I like it's still not over encumbered. Good. Never a dull moment. Whips and chains excite me, etc. Another mold. They're all over the place. I don't think I should step on that. Kite. Dark Justitia Mail. Dusty Book. Praise be to the Lady of Loss. She has, through Sister Ansar, taught Brother Saluve the true nature of our lives, that they are loss and nothing but loss. Though that through that sorrowful lesson he has turned from his fame and following and come to us into the Lady's loving embrace. But he has not left everything behind. The man once known as Siluv Yali brings with him his miracles of metallurgy. This dark alloy, adamantine, will let us spread the Dark Lady's will with new fervor. Alright, waypoint is good. Karlak, go pick up that mold. What? What's, what's over here? Oh. Animated armor. Okay. This animated armor has... Alright, first. Activate head attack. Second. Cutting action dash. Not enough movement. Not enough movement. That did 32 damage. Just short. Come on. Sometimes the only way right, out Merelda, is the... move up. Best be on my way. Is there anything I can firebolt? All right, one down. What should I do? Shadow Heart, move up. Move. Four damage is better than zero damage. I'm heating up. All right, Carlac. Uh, join a Starian up here and help him out. She's got so much movement. I love it. She rolled a critical miss, of course. Fourteen. Holy shit, this thing hits hard. Ha, ah, miss. Ha, ah, miss. Attack. I think I should dash. It's 
deal some damage to this bitch. Break them. Or not. Okay. Another fight. Let's go. Uh, all right, let's chromatic orb at first level. Miss, of course. I'm ready. Six damage. All right. All right, you. And again. Okay, another one dead. Uh, Carlock's gonna go. Uh, help these two. Astari can handle uh, the one up there. Miss, nice. Not a miss, less nice. Two damage. Ten damage. Oh, that was, those were some rolls. All right. Three charges. Okay. Uh, I'm sorry to stay there. Can't stay idle. Rilda. We'll just fireball. We'll save our spell slots. Need to stay focused. Let's cook with fire, baby. Got it. Is there enough movement? There is not enough movement. Soldier. But she will give it a better target. Oh, she just needs to... One damage short? Come on. <laughs> Miss. Miss. Nice. Can't target constructs. Thought not. Got him. Alright, let's see what they have on them. A great sword. Anything over here? One gill potion of feather fall. That's cool. I don't think fire resist potion will make me immune to lava, so I'm not gonna try. Carlac. Pick up this mold. Okay, not over encumbered. Good. What to do? Uh we are going to take a short rest. Oh, everybody got up to high health. Very nice. Anything else to do here? Ah, over there. Forge your blade in the fires and raise it in the mistress's name. Burning hands, very nice. of water that I don't need. Empty books. One eighteen gold, a gold chalice. Scroll of blink. Arrow of construct slaying. Deals double damage to constructs. Cool. Uh, we'll give those to a Starian. Gil.
Forge Construction Log. This decaying tome details the scientific and arcane principles behind the Great Forge's construction. The results of multiple experiments are explained in exhausting detail. Hammer Test 2.5.66.8 The Forge is functional, but operating at a scant one-third of its full potential. Oh, I bet this is, um... This is, um... This is a reference to it being an early access. Uh, and these are test builds. Um, and this first one would have been when only Act 1 was available. At current fractalization values, the hammer can force various iron alloys into molds, but adamantine remains unmoved and unmarked. Increasing levels of hypotorque to 6.94, doubling magma heat values. Hammer test 2.6.70.0. Test unsuccessful. So hot was the magma that the adamantine shattered entirely under the force of the hammer. The properties of superheated adamantine are intriguing, but I seek to mold it, not to crush it. Maintaining hypotorque levels, reducing magma heat values by one-fifth. Okay. Well, we got a waypoint. We can come back here whenever we want. Oh, uh, there's... Oh! We can go down there. Centuries of blazing heat have smoothed away the plaque's inscription. Ooh, okay. Well, we need the mithril to use with the molds. Hmm. What time is it? It's 5.15. Okay. Deciding if I want to keep going today. I think we will put a pin in this and come back to it. We'll save the slaves first, then do a long rest. Uh, then come back here and fight the Forge Guardian. Yeah. So that's where we're going to stop for today. I'll read my schedule and get off. Before I do, I would like to plug my Patreon. I make my living off of Patreon. It's my sole source of income. And I make enough to pay my rent and my bills, but I don't make much beyond that. And I'd really like to have something for emergencies. For medical emergencies, for if I need to replace stuff. You know, all that jazz. And I haven't had that for a very long time. So, if you could go to my Patreon, uh, which you can find either in the description of the YouTube video, or with the exclamation point Patreon command in Twitch chat. Did I already say that? I don't think I already said that. Uh, pledge a dollar a month, or a dollar per stream, or anything in between. Pledge a bunch per stream if you really want to change my life. Uh, I am grateful to everyone who pledges, because you're the reason I get to do this for a living, where I get to make content for you guys, and, um, and play video games on stream for an audience. I love my job, and I wouldn't have it without all of you. So, uh, as for the schedule... Tomorrow, uh, I'll be playing The Legend of Heroes Trails in the Sky for a patron. Friday, I don't have a stream planned. Uh, I'll be going to a doctor's appointment uh, at 11 a.m. and won't be back for a while. I may do some Baldur's Gate 3 after it. I don't know. Um, Saturday will, of course, be our weekly Final Fantasy XIV stream. Sunday will be The Legend of Heroes Trails in the Sky for a patron. Monday will be Imposter Factory for a patron, which I am very much looking forward to. Tuesday will be Wild Arms 3 for a patron. And next Wednesday, I don't have a stream planned because of doctor's appointments. Um, so yeah, that's what's coming up. Thank you guys for tuning in. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for watching. And I will see you next time.